Prince Harry launching a public attack on his stepmother, Camilla, the Duchess of Cornwall, in his upcoming memoir would be very damaging a source has claimed. Last week, the Duke of Sussex announced a deal with Penguin Random House Publishers and said he would be revealing his highs and lows in the memoir. Proceeds will be donated to charity but specific details about the amount has yet to be revealed. The memoir, which will also be published in an audiobook version, is to offer an honest and captivating personal portrait. However, a source has claimed Harry may document his fraught relationship with the Duchess of Cornwall which could be very damaging to the royal family. They told the Daily Mail, let's be honest, Harry has never been close to the Duchess of Cornwall. If he documents their fraught relationship in the book, it could be very damaging at a time when Charles is laying the groundwork for her to become queen. When Queen Elizabeth II either steps down or passes away, the throne will pass to her eldest son, Prince Charles. However, Buckingham Palace has previously stated Camilla will be known as Princess Consort instead of Queen in respect for the late Diana, Princess of Wales. When Charles and Camilla announced their wedding back in 2005, the palace said, it is intended that Mrs. Parker Bowles should use the title Her Royal Highness the Princess Consort when the Prince of Wales accedes to the throne. Charles and Camilla first began their relationship in the early 1970s but she called it off to marry Andrew Parker Bowles. Charles has since admitted he later had an affair with Camilla despite being married to Diana. Following Charles and Diana's divorce in 1996, Camilla and Charles were pictured together for the first time in public back in 1999. Speaking back in January this year, royal expert, Robert Lacey, warned the public is still coming around to the thought of King Charles and Queen Camilla. He said, this new generation of the royal family is very important to the crown and very important to the nation. As we look ahead, we obviously hope Prince Philip and the Queen are blessed with long lives, but mortality takes its toll. We are not quite sure what to think about King Charles III and Queen Camilla I think most people still are, coming around to the thought of Charles and Camilla. Whichever side you take, you have to acknowledge Camilla was the source of the conflict and the heart of the marital breakdown, of Charles and Diana, from whose consequences these boys, William and Harry, have suffered. Mr. Lacey went on to say how Prince William and Kate, Duchess of Cambridge, are more attractive to most Britons than Charles and Camilla.
A statement about the book was shared on Archul.com and said the memoir will represent the definitive account of the experiences, adventures, losses and life lessons that have helped shape Harry. Speaking about the book, Harry said, I'm writing this not as the prince I was born but as the man I have become. I've worn many hats over the years, both literally and figuratively, and my hope is that in telling my story, the highs and lows, the mistakes, the lessons learned, I can help show that no matter where we come from, we have more in common than we think. I'm deeply grateful for the opportunity to share what I've learned over the course of my life so far and excited for people to read a first-hand account of my life that's accurate and wholly truthful. Royal commentator Ingrid Seward warned Prince William is likely to come out worst in Harry's new memoir.